Welcome back. You're a Columbus native, so you all you know all about Market oh, Street. Yeah, yeah, I do. <laughs> the 28th <laughs> Annual Festival, it is now just days away. Yeah, uh, one of my favorites always has been, and tens of thousands of people will flood the downtown area this weekend. Almost three decades in, organizers say the fun never stops when it comes to hometown favorites. Shawanda Jones shares how one of the most recognized festivals in the South planted its roots and has now evolved into the community staple that it is today. Downtown Columbus may look a little calm now, but in just a couple of days, over 40,000 people will be swarming the streets. And have you ever thought about just how Market Street Festival got its start? Because we moved up here, it helped start Market Street Festival. Derek Rogers, WCBI's general manager, remembers how the station's original owner's love for music transformed an entire city's culture. That was just something that Frank decided to, to start and then eventually handed it off to the main street that had been developed and let them run with it. And uh, so we take a lot of pride in knowing that we had something to do with starting that festival, one of the top events in the Southeast. Frank Imes had seen the band War in concert and wanted to bring them to Columbus. He realized the good outdoor show could also bring people of all walks of life together. Market Street Festival coordinator Amber Breesland says that sense of community still lives on note for note almost 30 years later in the annual two-day event. On Friday night, everyone come down to the soccer complex for Market Readaville with our uh, our tribute to Jimmy Buffett band, they're called Buffett. It's going to be a great time and starts at 530. You can come dressed festively. Visitors can look forward to a paired head contest, limbo contest, and lots of shopping with over 250 vendors with food, drinks, and gifts. The event keeps downtown Columbus beautiful, historic, but also modern. Breezeland and Columbus Main Street director Barbara Bigelow agree that the festival is a sign that spring has officially sprung in the friendly city. Market Street Festival over the past 28 years, it's, it's grown to be a, not only a Columbus tradition, but something that people really look forward to. It's almost like the kickoff of spring. I and think like, so. Um, you know, and it's a real family friendly event. You know, children of all ages, there's tons for them to do. Adults can find a lot of entertainment as well. So it's a real family event for our community and visitors. Now, as a reminder, streets will begin to close around 5 a.m. on Friday, starting here at 3rd Street, stretching all the way to 5th Street. Make sure that you download our WCBI app so you can stay up to date with the latest times and road closures in preparation for Market Street Festival. Telling your story right here in downtown Columbus. Shawanda Jones, WCBI News. I think she wanted to have fun during that story. <laughs> yeah, I think so. All right, so uh, be sure to download the WCBI app for real-time updates and the latest in what you need to know for the big weekend.